Hi there, it's me again, Damian from Wetcom, and this is the second video about um, networking services that you can self-manage with the Realize Automation Console. This time, uh, I will show you firewall rules. Remember, we are here, this is the internet, and this is the same lab as before. We will focus on this. VM, which is the same Windows Server as before, and this Linux Server, which is in another um, network. Uh, the default firewall rule for this network is deny. And if you remember the last video, we have created a, a DNAT rule to allow the access to the Windows Server and this is the remote desktop session on this on the server on the Windows Server and let's see what happened if I can reach this VM from the Windows Server. So let's open prompt and let's do a ping to one let's put T. Of course, the Linux server uh, is not responding because the, the firewall rule uh, denies the, this, this connection, right? Because we have we are on uh, DMZ and this is uh, a private network. Okay, so to solve this. Let's create a DNAT rule. Let's go to the video automation, catalog, networking, and let's create a firewall rule. The rule name is from DMC205 to uh, app 201. Okay, description nothing. Next. Uh, we can choose a single IP or a range of IPs. In, the, in this case, a single IP is okay. From my Windows Server to, again, single IP or a range. 16, Next. And I can choose any of these protocols and all ports or select a port in particular. But in this case, I need ICMP, right? Because I'm doing a ping. So let's submit. And as always, you can see the, the progress. And in the request tab, but let's see what happened here. Now, suddenly the ping starts to work. Okay, let's back to the automation console and let's see the items, firewall rules. We create a, a separate category for firewall rule because maybe we need to create many rules okay so this is our rule again we can see the details the name uh, the source the destination the protocol etc okay it's as simple as that so now we can uh, ping the, the the server in the private network Let's see what happens if I delete the firewall rule, right? This is the rule, delete the firewall rule, submit, okay. The request is here, but I like to see what happened here, I guess. Okay, request them out. Now, the, the firewall rule is deleted, so the traffic is 
is, is not allowed. Okay, I hope you have enjoyed this, this video. See you next time.